Hello everyone, and welcome to my first Valkyrie Uprising tutorial. Now in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to compound cards, and how to get better cards by compounding. But first of all, let's look at these cards. Uh, these are rank 2, and all cards are ranked 1 through 4, and usually the higher ranked cards are better. Like, uh, a Kukri card rank 2 would give you 4% neutral resistance, but a 3 would give you 5%, and so on. There are some cards that are better, even if they're lower ranked. Like, for instance, an Alice card 3 gives 340 HP on shoes, compared to a Dark Lord 3 that gives 300 HP. Even though they're the same rank, the Alice is still better. And of course, there may even be some rank 2 cards that are better than rank 3. Now, in order to compound cards, you need converters, which are sold for 800 zenny from Merchant Miranda, found either in the north of town or in the south of town. Now, let's say you have a bunch of crappy rank 2 cards that are filling up your inventory, and you just want to get rid of them. Instead of just selling them to the NPC, just go down to this Magician Betty and pick the two cards that you want to try and combine. Is, well, their word is compounding, of course. But let's say this Oasis Mooka card, and you have another crappy Oasis Mooka. You pay the 3k Zenny and a converter, and pray. If you succeed, it'll say so. And then you can exit out and have a look what you got. In this case, we got a high art card 3. If you manage to succeed, you'll get a card 1 rank higher than the cards you used. So in this case, we got a rank 3. If you combine two rank 3s, you get a rank 4. For rank 4 cards, however, or to combine two rank threes, I should say, you need an advanced converter, which can only be bought with rubies from the cash shop. So here we are with another attempt at combining two rank twos, and this time it failed. And it says it fails, and then you can check, and oh look, we got a ghost ring card too. So even though it failed, we combined two crappy cards, and we got a really good card. Even though it's the same rank, it's still better. For you PC Ragnarok online players, this would be the equivalent of an old card album, which gives a random card. Even if the two cards you want to try and combine don't share the same name, you can still try and combine them. The result is still going to be the same, it's going to be a random card. Alright, let's see what we get here. And the result is a failure. But let's see what card we got. And it seems we got an even better card than last time. A Kukurin card adds neutral damage to a weapon, which is really good. Since the inventory is very limited in space, you want to try and keep the best cards you possibly can and sell the rest. Now usually I keep on to the rank 3's that I like and the rank 4's, and I sell the rank 2's and there are some crappy rank 3's and I just use those for more compounding and try and randomize it and get a better card that way. However, if you find it really difficult to get cards on your own, you can always go to the auction machine. Here I'm going to show you how to combine two rank 3 cards into a rank 4. But first we need to get a random rank 3 card because I don't want to use the ones I have in my inventory because they're really good. So we're going to look for a Wolf's 3 card, a cheap one. Something under 3k is what I usually go for. Or 3k. In this case we'll get a 3k one. I'll just play around with that. Once you have your cards, we go back to Magician Betty, and we'll try our luck at combining two rank 3s into a rank 4. But again, for combining two rank 3s, you need an advanced converter, which you can only buy in the cash shop for 10 rubies for 5 of them. Now, let's attempt it. Oh, but first, we need to see if we actually have them. Yes, I only have one. And I'm actually going to go ahead and just show you in the shop where you can find them. They're under the material tab and they do cost 10 rubies for 5. Just remember that. Okay, so now we're ready to try this and let's pick the wolf card and make sure you don't pick your other cards, the high orc card, and let's attempt it. Pray you get something. Yes, we got a rank 4. And what card is it? A wolf card 4. It's purely a coincidence that it happened to be a wolf card, but it's a rank 4. Earth extra damage 6%. Now my inventory is getting full, 
Oh look, all these cards I just made. And I'm at 30 out of 44. What to do? Okay, let's go register these in the auction system. Where do we go? Right here. Now all you have to do is talk to her, pick register item, and then you select the item you want to register, of course. In this case, we'll pick the ghost ring card too. You click on the zero, and you set the price. I'll put it to 18k. And you can only do two days. If you want to do seven days, you have to buy an item from the cash shop. And it's registered, and we're done. Now we can go to settle auction, where we check to see if our items have sold. And right now I have a wraith, a queef, and a ghost ring card in this list, which haven't sold yet. But if they do sell, I can get my money from here. Of course, you gotta remember that there is a fee to register them. Thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you next time.